So today is a special day. Is it a special day? It is a very special day. Hola. It's a special day because we're going to pick up Alp. Take the bus and head to the airport. Should be the last time and the only time we're going somewhere again like that will be for the guys here when we pick up their bikes at the port. But for me, peasant mode should be over after today. So we are back at the airport and now the next step is to find the cargo terminal. Hola, buenas. We just had a conversation to get here on the train to pick up the motorcycle. We're not allowed to bring in Kim and Jim. Um, so I have to take care of the paperwork first inside, then take care of the paperwork with customs. And then I can bring the guys in because I told them I can't do it on my own. That's what we're going to do now. So and I can't bring the camera inside, but I got the GoPro for now. So don't tell anyone. Now I am walking to a spot, to a building that's called Fast Air, and that is where the bike should be. It's just one of those days, again, you go into these with a blank mind and uh, a very neutral attitude, and you see where the day takes you because a lot can happen on these days. Sí. Ticket A92 and we're at A52, so now we play the waiting game. Welcome to the world of motorbike shipping. You walk in with one document, you walk out with a whole handful. This is the first step. Now I go to customs to get that sorted and then after, I have to go back and then I still have to pay storage costs. Price for the documentation was 50,000 Chilean pesos which should be about 80 euros or so. But it's happening now. This is the paperwork phase. Then there's still the bike phase. Sweet, so I just gotten out of the customs office and this is unbelievable. I didn't pay a dime. If this was New Zealand or Australia, just for them seeing me, it would have cost me something. There's always a cost. So I was very pleasantly surprised and I asked the man, wait a second, is, is this it? So I got this document here, which is for Alp, and she's good in the country for three months. If I leave, this one becomes invalid and then we have to start over once we come inside again. So that's customs, just like that. Bloody brilliant. So now we're gonna go back in. We're gonna finalize the documents at the warehouse. Uh, hopefully that will be it. I'm not gonna make any conclusions, but for the time being, it looks like in regards to imports and whatnot, that seems to be done, but you never know. Gracias. And we're out of the woods with the documents for now. Now I can go pick up the girl. Phase one. Now we had the phase two. Fellas weren't allowed onto the train because they didn't have any uh, passports with them, any documentation. So what I'm going to try and do is to get the bike off the terrain wrapped in a package. Let's see if we can make that happen. Bueno, tengo muchos documentos. Look who's there. Bueno, so I can only stay with the bike over there, they can't drop it off off the train, so the boys here have been amazing moral support. They had a bit of practice for when they're going to pick up their uh, bike. So I'm going to head out back and they're going home and then uh, I'm going to take uh, out for, uh, for a walk and then uh, fill her up with petrol. Help! How was your flight? I saw you wobble in there, so hopefully that cardboard protected you a bit against that, but we'll find out. Conocieron ahora mi novia. Ella dice mucho gusto. this I already noticed this here that means it backed up and now I see why because it bounced off support here I was going to zip tie that but I forgot about it in the evening wow 
that moved uh, quite a bit then. I forgot to tape off the terminals, so at the warehouse they taped the terminals to the seat here, which made them ready for the flight. This is a recurring theme, paint pulling with the cellophane on the black pieces. Luckily it's mostly out of sight. This is the last bit that's going on, the mirror, and we have to go find some petrol. Help is up and ready, and now phase three, petrol. Sure enough, found a ride, and now we're heading to a petrol station. un poco aquí en la botella por aquí la gasolina porque no tengo otro modo muchas gracias bueno buenos días me salvaste la vida muchas gracias and we're back and now with petrol so we're good to go that was like 15 minutes uh, we got really lucky there get help a nice drink and uh, show her a bit around without navigation i guess that's going to be phase four because i got to find a petrol station too on the way and i got to find the right way <laughs> to santiago city center with all the one-way roads but hey we'll make it well you're so thirsty aren't you come so far away so long no drink must be parched get you going soon enough girl there you go <laughs> what happened? The gasolina, claro. Ah, yeah. We're almost there now. Now we're going to head down to Santiago. Hasta luego. Muchas gracias. Chao. Buenas. Good to go. We got to drive on the right again. Been a while. City Armas here. I'll go over there. This looks familiar. Well, here we are. Do I know my Santiago or what? <laughs> I'm on a bike. Now we're back. Let's talk to the doorman, see what we can do here. All right, uh, that was a bit of fun. Already got a taste of the madness of what is to come. People turning left and right without indicating. 
just finding solutions to traffic situations and not having to worry about lane splitting. Not that I really do, to be honest. I actually really, really don't even have to think about it. That's, that's great, I love it. You just gotta keep your eyes open. But I'm gonna take my stuff off, put the bike here cozy, and then at night this gets locked up here, which is pretty sweet. So what we're doing tomorrow, we're going to Valparaiso. We got a Airbnb book for about a week. And we're gonna stay in a couple of weeks there, Jim. He made it. <laughs> First wheels on the ground. Alpha's still very thirsty. I'm gonna have a look at the carp. Really need to sort that out. Panniers are coming. They're close to coming. I'm excited. I'm super excited. This is really good. So let me know in the comments how happy you are to see Alp here in Chile, Santiago, South America. Please subscribe because you're gonna see a lot more. Drop a like. Alp says hi. She's excited too. I can tell. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow.